Hey guys, Matt DeWitt from MWD Adventures. Today we're going to review the Olight Arcfield flashlight. Let's take a look. So let's get into it. It's square. You probably have noticed that. It looks kind of weird. Kind of different. But it actually feels really good in the hand. It's somewhat small, compact. Probably about the size of a, a stick of gum. A small pocket knife. Let's do some comparisons. Um, let's walk around the outside first. So on the outside, we got this beautiful OD green color. Oh, it is beautiful. I like it. Uh, All Light makes this in a whole variety of colors, including like a safety orange. They've got a blue, they've got a black, they've got a desert tan, and this beautiful OD green. I really like this color. So on the outside, we'll start here. It's got your classifications because this one's got a special little feature. On the back is your proprietary magnet, and that is used for charging with your quick charger that comes with it. So you can just slap that on and it charges the flashlight, uses USB for that. And this works out great because you can use it to stick to anything metal. On the front, we got badging, our Olight badge down here. We got our battery status indicator and our dial switch, which switches between our two special functions. We've got our Olight flashlight on one side and we've got our class one laser on the other side. So as we look to the bottom, or I guess you'd say the side. We've got our standard badging here, Arkfeld, and then uh, at the top, it gives the color, temperature range. This is where the flashlight nerds go, wow, I know what that means. So you either have a NW or a CW. CW is a cooler blue LED you can get, or you can get one that's more of a neutral. So the neutral white or cool white is, okay, let's get nerdy, 57,000 to 6,000. That means you're going to have a bluer tint to your LED beam. Most people aren't going to care, other than the flashlight nerds. And the neutral white is going to get you more of a daylight look, that softer, warmer look. That's that NW. So this one is CW Cool White, and it's badged right here on the top of the flashlight. So uh, I got a nice heavy-duty pocket clip. This has some small little screws here. I wish they were something different, but um, you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. So the, the clip is pretty heavy duty. Um, I like the clip a lot. Um, I've been carrying this every day, daily carry for about three weeks now. Uh, full disclosure, Olight did send this to me for a review, but this clip has held up really well and I've really enjoyed it. Um, it slips into EMS pants. If you're a first responder, these square lights just work really well. Um, the closest thing I can compare this thing to, as far as uh, flashlights are concerned, is probably the Streamlight Wedge. Uh, it's very similar in shape. This was my carry up until I switched to the Olight. And if you guys want to see a comparison video between these two, let me know. Hit me up in the comments, and we can look at doing a comparison between the Wedge and the Arkfeld. But uh, as far as size comparison, let's look at that. We got a standard little pocket knife, so it's about that size. Um, here's a pen. So a little bit shorter than a pen. And uh, it weighs about 3.9 ounces, so it's fairly lightweight. I don't even know it's in there. When I go and put it in my cargo pockets, um, I don't even know it's there. I have no idea. And there's several times throughout the day I'm kind of checking my pocket to make sure it's still there. Um, but this clip doesn't let go. It's worked out well. So let's get to the features now on the front side. So you've got this special little dial. Uh, dial's really cool. Basically, it's got a button in the middle, and you've got a button in the middle, and you've got a slide dial. So the slide dial goes from flashlight mode to laser mode. Yes, lasers. It's got a green LED laser, class one laser built into the head, which is kind of cool. Uh, if you're an inspector, realtor, construction worker, uh, anybody that needs to point something out, you need something for a PowerPoint presentation, anything like that, a class one's going to be plenty for that. I have found the laser to be a little bit on the weak side. If I got to have a con, I would say that's it. The laser should be a little bit more powerful on this head, in my opinion. Um, I had a hard time pointing out things in bright daylight and sunlight unless they're close up. 
Um, the further you get away, the harder it is to see the laser. That's just a fact with a class one laser. So um, we've got a battery status indicator here. So when I rotate the dial and I flip the mode, you're gonna see nice green dots and it's gonna tell you, yep, I've got a full battery. If I hold this button in, then it's going to basically lock the flashlight out. See that red dot? That tells me that the flashlight's locked out and it's not gonna accidentally trigger. And then the way to unlock it is just to push it one time and you get it to unlock. So this flashlight has five brightness modes. You've got your low moonlight mode, which you could use for reading a map, something up close. And then Olight's famous little menu for switching through modes. So you hold the button down and it goes through its mode. So it has a total of five brightness levels. Then if I go and hit the button twice really quick, I get turbo mode, probably blind in the camera, but that's turbo mode, super, super bright. That's a thousand lumens right there, hard to look at. And if I go and do three times, I'm gonna do that one shortly, That that's a strobe mode. So five brightness levels, strobe and turbo, total of a thousand lumens. The other lumens are the moonlight mode is just a few lumens. Then you got 15, 60, and 300 lumens. Um, so yeah, outside of that, then you can flip this dial to laser mode. And then when you hit the button, you've got your laser. So the arc field is IPX7 waterproof rated. Uh, that means you can drop it in the water and it can be submerged. You can pick it up and it's going to be okay. Um, so... It is small, it's lightweight, it's compact. I really enjoy it. Um, been carrying it for, like I said, about three weeks. Absolutely love it. It is a nice carry price. You're probably wondering price. Well, if you know Olight at all, they run sales and they discount sales through every few weeks and so on. You can take a look and wait for a sale or you could go from our affiliate link down below and save yourself some bucks and get a discount right away and get your Olight Arcfield. So this will be listed down below with an affiliate link that does help and support the channel. You can also support the channel by subscribing, liking this video, sharing it with your friends, and just enjoying flashlights. Man, I'm going to take this on my little camping trip. We're heading up north this weekend for a little leaf peeping, and my arc field's coming with me. So thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, leave a comment down below if you got any questions for me. And like I always say, make sure you get out and do a little camping. So make sure you do a little camping with your flashlights. I'll see you next time, guys.